Hey guys, this is Done With Gaming Progress, and I just kind of wanted to take the time to make this short, uh, I guess this would be a vlog type video, uh, not something we do here too often, um, but I wanted to kind of talk about what's been going on today on Christmas, um, Merry Christmas by the way for those of you who celebrate Christmas, um, last year, uh, around Christmas, PlayStation and Xbox Live were taken down by Lizard Squad, uh, which is some stupid group of hackers who do it for the lulls or whatever, kind of like Anonymous was, like, back when Anonymous first was started, I guess, and now they're all into the activism, whatever, but anyway, this year, a different group called, what the, f uh, Skid, uh, NP, I guess? whatever the fuck that's supposed to mean, I don't know, uh, decided to take down PlayStation Network, Xbox Live, and Steam. So all three of these services have been really shaky today. Um, it's a very, very frustrating time uh, if you're a gamer and you've got like a bunch of new games for Christmas, gift cards for Steam or whatever. Uh, it's very frustrating right now. And it's very unfortunate, too, that this sort of thing happens. Um, it shows that uh, PlayStation is still susceptible to these kinds of attacks. Xbox Live is still susceptible to these kinds of attacks. And even Steam can have these sorts of things happen to it. Um, now, obviously, the Valve and, PlayStation and Sony and Microsoft are working to get all these services back up and... By the time of making this video, and then I gotta edit it and upload it, they'll hopefully be all back up. But it's really unfortunate that this kind of thing happens. Um, really what it is, though, is it's just uh, these hacker groups are just doing it to get attention. They want the attention, they want the fame, they want the notoriety. Uh, much in the same way that uh, when people, when these psychotic people do these the, these shootings or whatever, they're doing it in part for the notoriety and the fame because the media puts a spotlight on them when they capture them and they do all the f video footage for the weeks and stuff. Um, so don't talk about the hacker group itself uh, would be my advice. Uh, let them fade into obscurity. Uh, make sure that your account is safe. Um, make keep it, keep a track of your your credit card information. Make sure your um, if you have a bank account tied to any of these services, make sure that you're checking to make sure that your balance is where it should be. Check your your Steam wallet, your PlayStation wallet, your Xbox wallet. Make sure those balances are where they should be as well. Um, it's been suggested that until everything is back up on Steam. Uh, don't act. Don't attempt to go to the communities. Don't attempt to go to the Steam store. Um, just play what's in your library. The multiplayer services for the games in Steam are fine. Um, it's just if you try to access a store page and the community hub and stuff like that, that you can have these issues arise where either you're logged into somebody else's account, somebody gets logged into your account, and it's just a real big mess right now. And it's very unfortunate again, but these things do happen and they will they'll happen as long as there's a network to hack somebody will find a way to hack into it uh every network has a back door and stuff like that um that being said i did want to take the time to wish everyone a happy christmas hopefully you guys got a bunch of new games uh um maybe you got a new system or a new laptop or new graphics card or whatever whatever you got hopefully you're enjoying it uh, despite these issues uh, if you haven't already take the time to look at the gaming in progress uh, Christmas special how the Saints saved Christmas which uh, Dakota or which um, ogre actually got together and kidnapped Ares and they went and played it together. Um, so that, that was interesting. I'll have a link for that down in the, the description. I wasn't a part of it. Um, it wouldn't work anyway because it was saying it's, it's two players. So, um, but I just wanted to take the time to do this. It's this something I've been trying to do more often. i have just been tinkering with everything. You know, the camera's kind of kind of at a weird angle right now. Um, my plan is to get a tripod. Uh, so that way I can have it set up 
more and a, and a better angle and stuff like that. So uh, that being said, uh, if you happen to be someone part of these hacker groups that is watching this video right now, well, you can go eat a giant bag of dicks, you fucking douchebag, because uh, everybody should be able to, if you get a if you get a PS4 or whatever for Christmas, you should be able to just get on and play online, provided you have an internet connection, which you kind of need for these systems anyway. Um, so you're really, you're taking away from the fun aspect of people who are getting stuff for Christmas, uh, kids getting stuff for Christmas who may have been waiting for like years to get console. Um, like I know when I was a kid, um, I had like a PS2 for like a really long time and the 360 came out and the PS3 came out and I didn't get it till like near the tail end. I got a 360 and but I was still very happy. I would get to play online with my friends and stuff and that's part of the experience of owning a console or owning a, uh, a gaming laptop, a tower, whatever you play on. Part of the experience is being able to play with your friends and to have that taken away from you on Christmas of all days is very frustrating to say the least. Um, so let me know, uh, what you guys think of this whole, uh, attack, the DDoS attacks. Uh, if you guys, if you have had issues, let me know what issues you've had, uh, if you've been just fine. Some people, I mean, this stuff happens and some people don't have any issues at all. They're able to get on Steam's store page, they're able to get on PSN and Xbox Live and not have any problems. And other people aren't as, aren't as fortunate. It's really weird how that happens sometimes, um. But anyway, uh, just leave any comments, uh, questions, concerns you have down in the comments section below. Uh, I'm going to try and get this edited real quick and uploaded real quick. And uh, hopefully tomorrow or Sunday uh, I'll try to do some streaming, uh, maybe do some Rainbow Six Siege, some Fallout 4. We'll try and get something up. Um, um, but yeah, so hopefully you guys have enjoyed this video. Uh, hopefully you're able to watch this video. Hopefully they haven't taken down YouTube now as well. <laughs> I'll go on YouTube to upload this and be like, YouTube is down because of the fucking douchebag hackers. <laughs> um, but anyway, hopefully this gets all these problems get fixed and you guys can play online. Uh, and uh, if you haven't checked it out already, we do have a PlayStation community. Xbox doesn't have communities for, like, Thing different. I mean, they have like game communities, but like you can't create your own. But anyway, we have a PlayStation community for gaming of progress. So we have the website, we have the PlayStation community, we have the Facebook page, and I might open up a Facebook community for gaming in progress, and I might as well might also open up a Steam community for gaming in progress. So keep an eye on those things. I'll be sure to update you on those um, as I figure out what I'm doing and we figure out what we're doing. Uh, don't forget to check out our Minecraft server. That's MC, uh, well, I think, yeah, it's like mc.gamingandprogress.net. Uh, I'll have a link for that. I'll have a link to that in the description as well. Um, so yeah, that's pretty much it. If you guys have enjoyed this video, please be sure to hit that thumbs up button. And if you guys happen to be new here, don't forget to subscribe as well. This has been Devin with Gaming in Progress, wishing you a Merry Christmas, even though it's not snowing here.